Well, I'll be clear. I was a big proponent of a stimulus plan that was focused on uh, creating jobs in our country. I think we did need physical stimulus given the magnitude of the uh, recession, certainly the worst since the 1930s. I wasn't particularly in favor of all the elements of this stimulus plan that the House of Representatives passed. I think we could have done better. We should have put more of it into investment. Uh, that creates lasting jobs. It also, you know, if you invest in your infrastructure, you create a competitive economy going forward for the future. Okay. And that creates uh, jobs, and there's a big multiplier on those kind of jobs. Okay. And that investment goes away. It's not a permanent thing. Well, are you, at your own company, Jim, ready to rehire? Well, we have uh, called back a few people in the fourth quarter, and I think as next year unfolds, and uh, our current outlook is for sales to be up somewhere between 10 and 25 percent next year. A lot of uncertainty, but we'll gradually begin to call people back and to rebuild our, uh, our overall sales and our ability to ship product. So uh, I think it'll gradually begin to pick up as uh, 2010 okay. unfolds. Uh, Jim, I know that you're on the uh, Obama's economic advisory board. Are you going to be meeting with the president on Monday, and what will you be advising him? Well, the, the, the PRAB, the President's uh, Economic Recovery Advisory Board, we really get together uh, telephonically in subcommittees pretty much every week. So we spend a lot of time working on position papers and things on, for example, uh, infrastructure, job creation. One of the things I've been emphasizing is, you know, we as a country need to, we right. need to save more, invest more, and export more. Uh, and I'd like to see some of the trade agreements we have passed some of the pending FTAs will create jobs immediately. We need to move forward on those. Okay, and speaking about jobs, Jim, uh, I've got to ask you this because you're rumored on the short list of candidates to take over GM's CEO job when you retire next year. Uh, what can you say about that? Well, I have a terrific job at Caterpillar, and I'm looking forward to continuing that to uh, my rightful conclusion next year. But we'll have a, a great transition. Act. A yeah, second I, I, act. Is that, is that in the cards for you? Uh, I don't, I, don't, I don't think I'm on anybody's serious long list for General Motors. They need to, they need to get a chairman that's got a five to seven year runway, who has great confidence. The board has great confidence in, and the board allows them to run that company. Okay. And I think it is a company that can be rescued okay. and be a great company in the future. Jim Owens, we've got to leave it there. Thank you so much, of Caterpillar.